In this AVI you can see the 3D designer working with the PNID. The pump is placed and then correlated with the PNID. Property data entered in the PNID application is automatically copied to the 3D model. Next, the pipe is routed and information such as pipe name, fluid codes, temperatures and pressures are automatically carried over from the PNID. Items are then selected from the PNID and inserted into the 3D model, ensuring the consistency of the design. The pipe routing is completed and then inline items are positioned. Here we can see the valve being selected and then located in 3D space. This process continues until the pipeline is complete. You will notice that the PNID is constantly changing colour to reflect the status. The design of the pipe is almost complete. The final component to be modelled is the instrument. The instrument data, having been generated in SmartPlant's instrumentation, is retrieved from SmartPlant Foundation and the instrument is placed in the model. The piping design is complete, however an inconsistency still exists between the PNID and the model. SmartPlant 3D will tell us what the problem is. In this case, a mismatch in flow direction, which can automatically be updated. We can now guarantee that the 3D design is completely consistent with the design intent.